Do you know the difference between sanitizing and disinfection? So we're going to talk a little bit about that. A lot of people think that sanitizing and disinfection are the same, or that sanitizing is much greater than disinfection. We'll talk a little bit of history with that. So sanitizing is reducing the amount of bacteria on a surface. It doesn't necessarily kill the bacteria, but it does reduce it. This is helpful in areas like in restaurants where they need a measurable amount of ATP on a surface to deem it as safe. Now they're not telling you what is on the surface, they're just saying, hey, it's, it's below X amount, so this is safe. So this is used on surfaces, of course. You're using it on food, your children's toys, things like that. Disinfection, on the other hand, destroys the bacteria or pathogen on a surface. You wanna use this in hospitals, um, office areas, areas that are frequently touched, definitely when you're working with multiple use objects. So similar to uh, your stapler at your desk, a copy machine, things that you're touching and then someone else is touching right behind you. Now where you could say, well, I'm, I'm sanitizing it, that, that's all good and well, but we don't know what's on that surface. Depending on what you're using the surface for is what you should use either a sanitizer or a disinfectant. So keep that in mind. If you're cooking your dinner tonight on your counter and you're using a disinfectant, you may want to rethink that. You may want to use a sanitizer instead because a lot of times disinfectants have an ammonia compound in it and that's not good for the human body. So little things like that that you need to remember. So a little overview, dwell time, reading your labels on disinfectants. Sanitizing is a, a lot less aggressive. It's not really killing anything. And disinfectants are killing a pathogen or virus. So with that being said, I hope you guys learned the difference between sanitizing and disinfecting. Um, if you have any more questions, shoot us a call, drop us an email. Thank you.